daily challenge. And same old rules. It's in English everywhere, but we see... Are we on... Um... Man, I wish I knew flags better. I feel like we're getting pretty good information here. So many flags. Are we on Malta again, or are we... No? No. Everyone has flags out. What the heck? Dot com. God damn it. Siak Q Avenue. I feel like I'm getting maybe more Asian vibe vibes. I we I mean I should know what flag that is, right? But I don't. So where do we speak English? Singapore? That's usually it, right? Or something. I'm putting that marker down. I don't think that's a Singapore flag, though. Dot SG Philippines two, okay. SG Singapore. That's a reach. Uh, Philippines could be it. I'm usually expecting to see more. Aren't we getting some French, maybe Spanish vibes from Philippines as well? Good evening, Emperor. So if someone knows what flag that uh, that is uh now would be the time to say it you got 20 seconds dot sg is singapore okay nice so maybe it is a singaporean flag or something else well i'm we're gonna be relatively close then right there's nothing else to do here gonna be spot on maybe <laughs> pretty good pretty good I would have eh, basically had the same score if I put it in the middle, same distance away. All right, not too bad. Whew, all right, I'm always happy being in the right country, at least. Um, especially when it's a small country, you get a good score as well. And the daily challenge. Oh, this is going to be a nightmare. See so we can look at the sign driving on the right side of the road. Jedin Vozioldo. Um I was once in France. She was pretty cute. You're uh, speaking in riddles today, level one, I gotta say. So from the language we saw on that sign, I would say it's Eastern Europe, Middle Europe, something like that. I said let go, road one. If we can only find road one. So, I mean... Romania, we do have those type of letters here. 
Probably goes for Hungary as well. I'm putting something down here. Set let go, if I could easily spot that. Road 1. We don't know how the road... No, that's kilometers, actually. That has nothing to do with the road number. One minute left. Quickly. Should be close to the city area if it's just one kilometer. It's going to take us quite some time to get here. So that said, Sedleco, yeah, yeah. Doesn't seem to be a super huge place, so we're probably not going to be able to... Don't see, like, a web address. Well, I do. Dot .eu. Come on. <laughs> well... Yeah, well. Okay. Well, we were... Yeah, that wasn't that great. We're in northern parts of Czech Republic. Yeah. Didn't get too much information there. Mm -hmm. Don't think we're going to get too much information here. Um, so what are we thinking? Asia? Or South America? Mm, can't even make out if those. I can't make out if those are. What type of letters those are? Really difficult. Maybe we can have a closer look. We can. Mahatsinyo Andranomandevi. Can we go inside? Oh. Or Behemenescu. What the heck? Well, let's look at the sun. Uh, sun is in the north. I feel like we're not going to get any good information here. Maybe you could tell uh, from that sign we saw. Let's see if we can get out of here quickly. Oh god, where am I? I feel like these look uh, Asian to me. Uh, Sedleco. Was it Sedleco? Yeah, it was. Well, that was the previous uh, trip. Now we're someplace else. I feel like those look like uh, almost water buffaloes or something. Uh, so I might be on the wrong continent here because my first vibe was Asia. But then we saw non-Asian looking writing. Last minute. Oh, Madagascar. Okay. Okay. 
Well, we were correct. I'm I'm starting to become pretty decent at uh, looking at the sun, pinpointing north and south at least. Uh, it's not the first time we were kind of almost spot on. Also the second time we've been on Madagascar. And I guess it makes sense with this with the words that we saw. I gotta remember that this is a place. I mean, I know it's a place, but yeah. Because it didn't sound Spanish or Portuguese at all, the words that we saw. So I gotta think of this place. Alright, one point. Pretty good. Were we not here just now? Hmm. Can't spend too much time looking around. Una via. Towards the sun. So I would say South America meeting. What? The, no, there was a dog on the roof. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Look at this guy. Wow. All right. Hello, little dog. Parada. Hmm. Okay. So very far south, I would say. It doesn't look tropical at all. What do we know about the sun? Nothing. The sun has disappeared. Is this the sun? I don't know where the sun is. Yeah, I'm not getting any information from that. Maybe the bus over here? I'm not allowed to go that way. Okay. Alcaldia? Doesn't tell me too much. Kalima! Uh, that is a flag? Right? That's like Colombia, but that's way too far north. That is way... that's not the climate we're seeing here. Right? Right? Maybe I should move my marker if... Uh, I mean, that might, might have not been a flag, could just be something else. I feel like the climate doesn't seem uh, correct. That's right on the equator. That's got to be way more tropical, right? I... Go a little... Uh... 11 seconds. God damn it. I don't think Arg Argentina, but, you know... Could be Uruguay. Hmm. Could all... I should have gone with the flag. And I kind of fell into, since we are kind of close to the coast, the climate does tend to be a little bit harsher. And we do get climate that seems more extreme north or south. But I always expect to see the ocean when that is the case, because this is right on the freaking equator. And that is not what it looked like. But we got some cold air coming in from the ocean, I guess. And we're on a mountain range, so I bet it's... I don't know. I got no good excuse here. So let go sounds foreign to me without the sea. More palm trees. I feel like every time we see palm trees, I <laughs> I don't get a good score. Tunam Hazard Zone. Mm. 
this could be Asia, this could be South America, this could be Madagascar. Oh no. Something providers. We got English speaking stuff. We also have narrow bridge. Are we finally on New Zealand? Could be on an wow, look at this place. Oh my god. It's beautiful. We're getting no sun information here. Basketball court. Okay. Tsunami hazard zone. Oh, that's what it said. Could it be... Someone suggested Philippines before when we had English on signs. But I thought it could make sense because we're definitely not in Singapore this time around. Indonesia? Philippines? Hmm. There was a note on the poll. Yeah, I saw that, but the text would have been really hard to read. It was super small. Fine print. Cannabis? Where are we? Ladies? They look South American, but they... what? 30 seconds. Where in the world are we? Are we in Asia? South America? Are we on some of the American islands? But no. And we're driving on the right side of the road, if that helps. It doesn't. Four seconds. Well, all right. We were basically between Asia and South America. On the American Samoa. All right. Man, it's really impressive with these small islands. You can't even see them when you're zoomed out. And then... There they are. Yeah, well, that's our first visit here. So, it's gonna be... Yeah, man, there's a lot of islands all over the place. Fiji? Alright, 30 points. Pretty good. You're now a master hiker. Well done, you've gained a new title. Thank you. All right, that wasn't super good. The Singapore one was the only decent one, I think. Then we were off country, we were off country, we were off country, we were off country. Oh no. Not that great. Yeah, the only one above 4,000 was the Singapore. And there, you know, whatever you guess on, it's gonna be pretty good. And it was downhill from there.